Okay guys, so we just made it to Zavert. We just activated our first side quest. We seen Malik's credential credentials. So let's go ahead and explore this place. It's a big snorry area. Oh nice. Rains Carter. Lloyd Irving, wake up. Haha. -ha. They used to I think they called her refill in the Japanese version, which is weird. I'm so used to rain. Three of my men disappeared on Zavar, but someone rescued them. Ah, no one cares about your man. Who discovered? Bottomless pipe. Piping up. Wow, Zavar is like a whole town full of pipes. I can't imagine what it must have taken to construct all of this. Stop that, Sharia. A person could really get hurt if they fell from this height. Oh, you're worried about me? Oh. Look at all the shiny little coins at the bottom. You see? I knew she'd end up copying you. I should have known that was the reason. Huh? Huh? Oh, uh, I'm Asbel. I, I just don't understand why Sherry says some of this stuff. I'm so completely... Ooh, which fish should we give it? Okay, b back to my Asbel impersonation. Oh, I'm so completely oblivious to the people around me and how they feel. Because I'm Asbel Launch. Completely useless. Nah, I'm just joking. They say that Mount Zaver is the most inhospitable. In big words confuse me. <laughs> my stupid heater died. Might as well sit around outside for all the good it'll do me now. I wish the big boss would hurry up with his grand plan, don't you think? Uh, actually, forget it. If I'm going to be th this co, I might as well just start spending my breaks in Pendel Tower. What's wrong with that guy? Grand plan, exactly. Maybe we should follow this guy. Yeah, this guy's still talking about his three men. We checked that house out already. We checked that chest out already. Was that a discovery? No. Move it. Child, do you want to buy a plushie? I made it myself. A cat's plushie. It's only for... A yeah, let's go ahead and buy it. It's nice to have when you're feeling lonely. Alright, so we already got another plushie we can give to that one girl. Alright, we'll talk to that guy later. It seems... Oh, that poor child all by herself again. Oh, I'm sorry. How can I help you? I'm guessing that's her mother that we're speaking to right now. Uh, the lonely woman or the lonely girl in her bed. This is her mom, the shopkeeper. Seven stamps. Now we can buy salmon. Let's buy a weed charm. Let's buy two of them. So now we get another weapon or item we can buy. Bam. Oh, nice. So the suspicious powder actually gives you the red, uh, the red uh, herbs in this game. Is there any way you can provide a larger ration for Krias for the children? We know we're almost there. The rumors are true, so just hang on a little longer. Check. It says Findel's Tower original name was Iron Spike. I had no idea. You're an odd bunch, aren't you? I better not catch you causing any trouble. Shut up, old man. Before we kick your ass. No more suffering. It's difficult for me to believe Strata and Fendel are on the verge of war. 
So, what will happen if there's a war? Is everyone going to die? Not everyone. We won't let that happen. Asbel won't, I won't, even Hubert won't. But whenever I think about dying, I get scared. It's like my whole chest tightens. What? I wonder if that's a part of her remembering the times you protected us. Come here, Sophie. I'm sure you just had a bad dream. There's nothing for you to worry about. We're here for you, no matter what happens, okay? It's our turn to make sure you're out of harm's way. Sharia? We've already gone through so much. I don't want anyone to have to suffer again. A surprising theory. Oh, wow, too scary. I see. That's a great point. Well, it was fairly obvious. What's going on? We're checking out Asbel. Doesn't he seem a little strange to you? <laughs> what? Maybe. Guess I should just ask him. Hey, Asbel. Hmm? Listen, you've been acting all distant lately. Did something happen? Well, Pascal? Yeah? The truth is, it's... Surprise! Huh? What? Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Pascal. Oh my gosh, what? You guys are <laughs> the best! What? Something like that? Something like what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> wow, that was so silly, dude. Pascal was so silly. Uh... You know the thing that's happening, world. Word is, even the Chancellor is gonna be there. Oh shit. The drug meet a long, long time ago. Well, okay, around 20 years ago, some young soldiers staged a rebellion. Care to warm your bones with a shot of chili pepper liquor? Oh, oh, pardon me, we can't serve minors. Well, screw you too. I don't wanna talk to that guy again. I wanna talk to, to, to the guy behind the counter right now. Here we go. A soldier told me that if the next round of experiments go well, Aelith won't be a problem anymore. They must be messing with the Valkyness. Let's review the request. We have the red wine. Oh wow, we bought all those freaking weak charms for no reason. My friend just got promoted and I was hoping to make his favorite food, but I don't really have access to it, so... There you go. Oh, here's the Rockagon fur that we need to... Oh, well. That's where we freaking hand in the Rockagon fur at. But we don't have it right now. Hey, are you into dualizing? Because I got some great advice to share with you. If you sell weapons that have a, that's been dualized, you fetch a higher price than usual. Oh, you already knew that, eh? Well then, I got something else I bet you didn't know. The more items you sell at high prices, the more respect you earn. You might even get a title out of it. Huh. I'll keep that in mind. So I'll keep dualizing my weapons from now on. Every chance I get. I gathered up all the trash in my room and threw it in, the, in this trash bin. You wouldn't believe the praise. But uh, don't go leaving your trash in your room, you hear? Is there anything in here for us to see? Nope. Just a guy talking about trash. Ooh, look at the shiny. They're extremely strict about who's allowed to visit the sea of the ice up north. What's the sea of ice, you ask? It's a frozen stretch of sea that extends north of Zavert. Let's get this shiny. Bloody Rose Seas, nice. I'm glad we came upstairs. And we found some more rice, yes. All right, so let's, let's actually rest here. See if there's any skits. Do 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 do. Nope, doesn't seem to be any skits. All right, so let's head out, explore the town even a little bit more. Gray skies and white rooftops, as far as the eye can see. Such is the scenery of residence in Zopper. Usually when you're at the snow level of the game, that means you're almost done with the game. The tower's original name, what's this about? So I'm guessing that's a password hint. I th what was it? 
it was Spike something. Spike something? I forgot. Findle's Tower would be a truly terrifying place to sneak into. Alright, let's check out the residence. Let's raid the residence. There's gotta be something in here. Look at all these toys. Look at all these. We can't pick any of this up? Oh, that sucks. Best princess stories. Alright. So we found four of the princess books. But I still want to pick up all these goodies over here, but we can't. Okay. Alright, it's just turtles right now. Halt. Proceeding beyond this point is strictly prohibited. Oh, can go that way. They say that Mount Zavert is the most in high. Wow, it's the same. It looped around, so I guess that's it. Alright, so we gotta talk to the soldiers with the squiggly lines around their head to advance the place, I guess. To advance the story. So let's talk to him. There you go. It's the latest order. This is a pretty big list. You planning to invade a country or something? Nah, this is for, you know, that. Alright, that. So, um, uh, you think that's gonna work out? <laughs> Man, they don't tell me nothing. But I managed to overhear a juicy piece of gossip. Lay it on me. Apparently the big boss at the Ministry of Science has been making regular trips out of the city. That means we're close. Wow, they're supposed to be secretive, but we're just standing right behind them right now. <laughs> so it's okay to get my hopes up? <laughs> Absolutely, my friend. Things are about to get real busy around here. Alright then, I'll be back to pick up the goods. Man, what the hell is going on? Sorry, there's been a little problem. We had to close up shop until it's resolved. Raw materials we mined on Mount Zavert were lost when we were attacked by a strange monster. I'm guessing... Uh, whatever. And we never checked this way, though, did we? It's another... Wow, we can't even go up there. Let's go talk to this last squiggly line. Did they send you to bring me back? Oh no, thank goodness. I was worried there for a minute. Lately, my department's been doing a lot of work with the balconies. I had to get out of there before the stress drove me insane. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's for the good of Fendo, all right. I'll get back to work now. But don't tell anyone about the balconies coming, okay? I'm uh, not supposed to mention it. Work with the balconies? Ah, there we go. It sounds like Fendel really is conducting experiments on their Valkanis, but we still don't know where it is. I'm still surprised the Amarsians are a The Americans? Me too. I thought they were all extinct. Man, this is bad. This is really, really bad. Is it now? What are you getting so worked up about? See, Bendel's Valkanus is kind of wonky, so it's really hard to extract Elith from it. It's also really dangerous to extract Elith from it. She knows a lot. And if this little experiment of theirs fails, boom. Um, what do you mean, boom? Explosions. I mean, boom! Like the <laughs> entire country of Fendel being wiped off the map. That kind of boom. Remember that crater we saw on the way here? That was when a Creus about this big decided Oh to man, that's gonna be a huge Tiny explosion. Creus, huge crater. Now, think about what would happen if the entire Valkanus exploded. Damn. How do you know all this, Pascal? Because she's smart as hell. Because I made the crater. <laughs> I this is bad. I'm pretty sure they're using my research for their Valkanus experiment. I knew it as soon as I saw those soldiers weapons at Warrior's Roost. The principles are totally based on my work. But wait, I thought they were using a Marcian American technology. technology. Yeah, they are. I'm an Amarcian. She's an American. What? She's an Amarcian. 
Okay, so that's kind of surprised me. But anyway, let's continue this next time when we split the video here. Holy shit. Things got interesting.